We are live here from the Wright Family Pavilion in Hartford, Connecticut, where the Stony Brook Seabulls will be playing the Hartford Hawks for the America East semifinal. Winner will play Friday either at Maine or Albany. And welcome here to this edition of Stony Brook Women's Basketball. I'm Jim Fortune alongside Zach Wilson. Here's Johnson. Passes the timeline, goes right. It gives it to Matthews. She dribbles right. Crossover. Picks up a dribble. Pagan at the right elbow. Going right. Defending hard with the pull-up. Back rim. Got it to go. Stony Brook draws first blood. 2-0. 9-0-2 left in the first quarter. To Gucci from and Shea in the right corner. Back to Matthews. Top of the key. Here is Pagan at the right elbow. Pull-up. Jumper. Glass. And it's good. 4-0 Stony Brook. 8-14 left in the first. Then gets it to Johnson. Johnson finds Boucher. Get Boucher off the glass. Got to go. Boucher, four quick points off the bench. And Stony Brook up 10-7. 317 left in the first. Here's Matthews towards the right side. She's created some separation. Dribbles. Eight seconds of the shot. Go get the screen from Pagan. She's going left. Hard to the bucket. And gets it to go with the left hand. She is just so tough. She knows how to get those layups in. Stony Brook with their biggest lead, 16 to nine, 7.35 left to go in the second quarter. Here is behind the back, tries to find Matthews. Matthews able to split the defense. Here's Zeiss in the corner from three. Bang, knocks it down. Haley Zeiss, her first points of the game. Only averaging 4.2 on the season. He had a wide open look and buried it from the right corner. Here is Young on the right side. Here is Douglas going left. Finds the Costa. The Costa goes right on Matthews. She'll keep it. She'll facilitate. Goes to a bed. A bed. A three-pointer. Self and retaliation. Right in the face of Shorty Johnson. And a bed. She's got five. Leading the charge for the Hawks. 19-14. Stony Brook leads. 5-20 left to go. Johnson gives it to Pagan. Pagan trying to find. Goes left. Pull up. And have a nice block there by Smith. Offensive rebound by Zeiss. Here's a wide open three from the corner. Good by Jarrell Matthews. Her first three in the game. And Stonerbeck is now up eight. 22 to 14. Young, 13 on the shot clock. Young looking for a screen from Smith. She'll use it. Going left. A bed from three from the wing. Got it. The left wing is open for a bed. And she cuts deficit to five for Hartford. And she leads the way for Hartford with eight. 31 second differential to the shot clock and the game clock. Johnson open in the corner. She is double teamed. Finds Pagan with the left and it good. Left layup for Pagan and she gets it to make it 26 19. Stony Brook. 30 seconds left. Pagan keeps her pivot. Here's Zeiss. She'll go right. Loses the ball and it's stolen by. J this is DaCosta for Hartford. DaCosta with the left hand and lays it up and in. Costa, she's got six points, 26-21, Stony Brook. 9.24 left in the third quarter. Pagan at the left elbow, nothing there. She may have traveled. Here's Johnson, pump fake, nothing available. She's trying to get a three, she got it. Bang, knocks it down from the right wing. Johnson, her first three, and she has tied the record for threes in a season. For Stony Brook, and, and one bucket for Hartford right back by Sierra da Costa. How about a three for Stony Brook and possibly a three-point play the hard way for Hartford. Rebounded by Cherry. Uh, good box out there by Cherry. Here she comes in transition. No one stopping her. Dumps it off to Provence on the left side. And Provence puts it in. 33-29 Stony Brook. 5-17 left in the third. Here's the Costa. Good defense by Matthews. She goes right. Setting up for Douglas in the corner. Here she goes left. Setting up for DaCosta, a deep three from the wing, and bottom! Sierra DaCosta knocks it down from three, and she's now got 12. Ta uh, sorry, Stony Brook 33 to 32. They lead, nine on the shot clock. 225, here's Pagan, elbow jumper, bottom! We haven't seen that much of her since the first half, and now she's finally getting that rhythm going again. Eight points for the sophomore out of New London, Connecticut. Here's a bed. A bed going left. She'll set a three. Bottom or back. Oh, the long two, actually, from the official. And got the screen from Awapa Joe. And she's got 12 also. And a bad pass from Matthews. And it's stolen by Alexia Douglas. Here's Awapa Joe. 
to a bet about the left hand layup and Hartford has the lead, 36-35. Going left, 13 seconds differential between the shot clock and the game clock. Young, a tough, difficult jumper, buries it. From about the right elbow contested. She buried it, 40-37 Hartford. Matthews past the timeline. She'll go right to the cup, lays it in to Pagan. And Pagan's got the last six for Stony Brook and they're down one, 40-39. Cherry almost backcourt, she's okay. She has to dump it off to Pagan on the far side. And Johnson for the record, got it to go. She and a new record for three pointers made in the season is broken for Stony Brook Shorty Johnson with 95 threes and Stony Brook takes the lead 42 to 40. Johnson gives it to Matthews, Matt with a left hand shot, can't get it, and Pagan the put back and the foul! A little roar from the New London native as she buries the end one, and Stony Brook is up 44 to 42, and Pagan is, has 14 points after that made bucket. Here's Johnson, spin move, nothing there, going right. Finds Pagan, wide up in the corner, Zeiss got it! Zeiss has eight points, and they reclaim the lead, 47 to 45. A bag gets a screen from Awabajo, Awabajo open for three, she looks to claim the lead, and Hartford strikes back with another lead change. 48-47, 7.37 left, and here's Zeiss. Zeiss, she's trapped in the corner, trying to keep it in her possession. Cherry has it going right, Ume picked up her pivot. Here's Pagan on the pump fake with the left hand layup, and it's good. She leads the way with 16 for the Sea. What's the one point game? 50 49, 556 left to go. Hartford leads to the scream, setting up a Waba Joe. Pump fake, sets the three anyway. Back iron, no good. Rebounded by Young. And the pump back, 54 to 49. Back to Johnson. Johnson gets a screen. Nothing available. Finds Pagan. Here's Matthews for three. Got it! Big time Knocks it down the corner. Six points for Matthews. It's a two point game. 54 52. 315 left. 13 seconds left on the shot clock. 301 left on the game clock. Two point lead. Hartford up 54 52. Here's DaCosta for three. And she nets it from the corner. DaCosta coming up huge here in this second half. And she's got 20. It, it, this, is, this is playoff basketball, Zach. Here's Sierra going right out. Spin move on! Sherry, and that was wicked. Put her in the blender with the spin cycle. And Tacosta leads away with 22. Here is Cherry going there. Zeiss from three in the corner, and she nets it. And Zeiss ties her career high with 11. It's 59 55, Harford. Oh, what a huge three, and the confidence has to be sky high for Haley Zeiss. Here's the Costa, she's got the hot hand, cherry on her, left elbow, nothing there. She'll go right to a bet, a bet going left on Matthews. She may have picked up a pivot, nothing there. Here's Young for three, got it! Oh my goodness, a contested three, and she knocks it down. Matthews down the floor, gets it off the layup. 62 to 57 right there. Wow, what a shot by Jade Young. She's got 11, minute 18 left, and it's crunch time for the Seawolves. To a bed, a bed, has it. Double team, here's a Wamba Joe for three. Back iron, no good. Rebounded by Matthews, here's Johnson, and she picked up her dribble on a double dribble. Oh, she had the chance to pull it. Saw that Pagan was cutting, and the transition defense is coming back, and a costly turnover for the Seawolves. Stony Brook for the woman can stay alive. And it's a bad pass from Zeiss, and it's intercepted by Jade Young, and that might just do it. Oh, what was Zeiss looking at? Try to find the cross-court pass for Shorty Johnson and Jade Young was right on it. So 0.4 seconds left to go, and Hartford is about to celebrate. Here's Zeiss to Matthews, lays it up and in, and that will be the final point for Jarrell Matthews in his Stony Brook career, and Hartford 
it will advance to the America East Championship to play Maine on Friday. They beat the Stony Brook Seabulls in the Chase Family Arena today, 64 to 59. And it was a terrific performance from Sierra de Costa. Low and Lindsay of Bed, they combined for 38 of Hartford, 64 points. We are going to say goodbye here from the Chase Family Arena in the right family pavilion in West Hartford, Connecticut on the campus of Hartford University. The Hartford Hawks defeat the Stony Brook Seabulls in the American East semifinals 64 to 59. I'm Jim Fortune alongside Zach Wilson, Matt Mank, which our broadcast engineer, and you're listening to the longtime home of Stony Brook Seabulls Athletics here on 90.1 FM WSB Stony Brook. Have a great weekend, everybody.